just fire the fuck up?
the Jaguars, and we have a record out. It's uh, two songs. It's 30 something minutes. If we play both the songs. Well, you can see the issue. So we're going to play one of them. Huh? This is called The Fog of War. Last 
swords
which is our, our larger record. Uh, it's going to be called um, By the Time Your Rocket Gets to Mars. And uh, I'm sure the uh, massive global ramp-up campaign starts any moment. <laughs> any fucking <five> second. <laughs> One of the exciting things about that, though, is uh, our friends at Voodoo Donuts have an awesome vinyl label, and they're going to put out the double vinyl of it. And uh, by the same time, I go on a year-long paleo diet. Can't eat any of donuts. Can't have any of the herb, any of the donuts. Move to Texas. songs on it. it would sort of be the title song. A lot of this was written by my son Judah. He was too young to get a royalty lawyer. That's the awesome thing about writing songs with your children, because you get all the money.
13 million people Breathing in faith and hope and sweat In the lapis and the marble
If you know us at all, you know that we try, like, the next four nights, um, we're playing tomorrow at the, I don't know what the hell it's called, Southeast Wine Collective. Donuts, legal pot, big barrels of wine right behind my head. Yeah. Water, water, every fucking way, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Anyways, Wine Collective, and then um, New Year's Eve, we're at, at the Mission Theater. And then the following two nights, we're at the Doug Fur. And um, we hope you can come to all of them. Because we're that kind of band that tries to not repeat songs over the course of... For instance, the refugees play the same eight songs. <laughs> yeah, really great at them. <laughs> but we are promoting a new record, and we have to teach ourselves that that means playing the songs a lot. So we played this one earlier, and we're going to play it again with just as much gusto and feeling. You feel it? Crazy, huh? <laughs> so, a number of these songs, like that last one, they were written in uh, places like Kabul and Istanbul. And, and uh, so was this. And they were all kind of, when I was saying that my son Judah was really influential on it, he was really into space. And instead of writing songs about Plastic vests and, and machine guns, they let it be more fun to write songs about space and fairies. And... You feel that? Yeah. Okay. Anyway, so here's another one. This is called Cosmic.